What is up guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna to be unboxing this package that just got delivered to my door. As the title says, some drilled and slaughtered rotors. So let's get started. box was supposed to get here next week and um, so I really surprised it got early I got here early a whole week never happened so. but um yeah break labs thank you so how to break in new brake loaders and pads, instructions, stuff. Ceramic brake pads, stuff. Ceramic disc brake pads, stuff. And three boxes within one box. the heavy ones. Mm -hmm. Brake rotors and stuff. This one just says solid. So I have no idea what that is. start with smallest first and then work our way up to the biggest one so this one just says ceramic brake pads so I guess there's pads in here four pads I don't know if I don't know if mine are ceramic. Do stock cars come with ceramic brake pads? Do they even make other pads that are ceramic? I don't know, you guys tell me. So just have them here. This bigger one says ceramic disc brake pads. Guessing more pads. Yeah, because there's only four there. Two. Probably the front or rear. I got from this one. Great pads. Four more brake pads. I don't know if these are the front or rear again. I don't remember if the front ones, if the bigger ones go up front or in the back. I want to say in the back, but who knows? Maybe I could be wrong. This is so unnecessary. You could fit both of these in one box. Whatever. These are the rotors. Sound like it. Nice. So I ordered them in gold. They're not really, really gold as the picture, as they looked in the picture, but 
pretty cool. It's different. In person, it looks like a green with pink-ish, orange-ish. I don't even know. I don't know if the camera picks it up, or maybe it looks gold on camera. Hopefully. We'll see. So that's one. Put that over here. I'm guessing the same thing is on this one. These things are pretty big. They feel bigger. Um, I feel like they're a bigger disc than my 240, but who knows? I could be wrong. Pretty sure they are though. Because even the 240s are four lug. S13. Unless you have the S15. I mean S14. Even then you can have some S14 with four lug. But um I think these are bigger. They did a horrible job taping these things. So these are the ones, again, I don't know if these are the front or the back, but they have the, I don't even know what this is called, the double wall thingy going on. I think these are the back. I'm trying to remember if the big ones go in the back or the front. I'm saying the back, but like I said, I could be wrong. These are more pink than the other ones. These are really pink. I don't know if the camera's catching it or not. But I actually like them. They're unique. I definitely have never seen these on any car I've seen. Um, I didn't even know they existed until I was searching up brake, brake rotors and stuff because I need new brakes. And these popped up, so I was like, why not? Let's try it out. They're, they're really cool. I mean, even though they're not gold, it's unique. They're not the same silver rotors you see on every single car. And they're um, drilled and slaughtered, so upgrade even though my car has like 10 horsepower because it's a 318 but it's okay so um so yeah guys i will be doing a review on these since they are ebay rotors um see how good they are i mean they look they're 140 142 um that's not that cheap so i don't think i went cheap on these um Hopefully I'm right. So I will do a review. Once I have like a good time on these. And I will be doing an installation video. It's the first time I do it on my E36. So um, it'll be a learning process from hopefully it's not too different than 240 because I used to have a 240 and I used to do everything to that car. Um, BMW is a little difficult with everything. So um, hopefully it's a universal brake changing process and if it is then we could get it done quick um so yeah so stay tuned for those two videos and um thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one